Hey chess lovers, welcome back to the chess yard. This is Dhere Bagga and today I'll be playing the final blitz on Lee Chess. And during the game, I'll try to be as instructive as possible like always, making sure that there's something to be taken away as a learning that helps you improve your game to the next level. Now before we start off with the game, I request you to subscribe to my channel and press on the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of the videos that I'm posting up daily without a miss. So yeah, let's start off with the game and see how it goes. Got the black pieces. I'll play the Karukan defense, which starts with c6 followed by d5, the main move. And opponent does take, which is strange because if you have played f4 already, you will try to proceed and occupy the center. But that's not what opponent does. Uh, gives me a chance to develop the bishop as well on g4, pinning the knight as well, which he tries to remove straight away. But I can proceed with my pawn to e6, just trying to play on the merits of the game and then playing bishop d6 maybe next queen comes in in this diagonal wonderful diagonal okay he tries to kick my uh, bishop away i'll take this if he takes with the rook is the only way to save this otherwise he's closing a pawn i have a battery lined up which would make sure that his bishop is probably not very active or he takes with the bishop and lose the pawn up to him takes with the bishop okay uh, any plans maybe maybe he's trying to take on this next and have a discover attack on my queen and then do i have anything maybe i have let's see okay so he was prepared for it yeah, i think he'll take this and if that i'll take give a check first he has to move away and then i take his bishop as well so he better be prepared for that he does okay check it goes there oh that was nice of him because now if i take rook comes here so he gave a thought about that oh well done thankfully i saw it otherwise that was going to be a mess preparing to castle now on queen side unless he takes on the knight of course if he does then i won't if he doesn't, I'm going to take this pawn and probably offer him queen exchange and then take. My knight gets more active, what better than that, and I get a free pawn. So that was well done by the opponent there. Okay, I take. Probably rook here now. Doesn't make sense though. So I develop the knight instead. Okay, I'll castle. Get my rook on the B file, trying to take on the pawn, trying to pressurize later on on G2 as well. Okay, knight is on a good square, I would say. If here and he attacks, I can go here, still defending my knight, and I have a good way to folk. So shall I go with the knight first? Yes, I should. I'm expecting this now and I go here because he must be thinking I'm going to go for a fork here with a knight on g3 oh he offers queen exchange rather now if I go here is there some nasty cheap tricks I take no it doesn't work I give a fork, doesn't work. So I have to take, I think, another option. Okay, I wanna play f5 here, defending my knight. Knight is good in the center. If he tries to get his rook here, I can still have a fork. So that's why I want to keep my knight there, at least for now. Pawn forward is a decent enough move, I think. Uh, takes, takes, uh, 
mm, I might do that on something. So yeah, let's get the rook first, depending the pawn. That could have been tricky because if I play forward, I yes get to take uh, after he takes, I take back with the knight, but then he's coming with pawn forward and I can't defend this pawn anymore. Okay, where is he going? Here, here, no, I don't think so. He's just trying to distract me and have a rook lift, attacking the knight, defending the pawn always. Rook lifts are nice. You can go back as well. If he tries to come back, maybe I'll go with the rook d8 next. He doesn't. Okay, what have we got? I'll play pawn forward to a5, maybe a4 as well. Play mm, g pawn as well. Or maybe just force the issue here. Goes back strangely. Oh, why is he going back? I don't know. And keep my pawn there. Maybe try and go here. Offering knight exchange. My knight is pretty better there. Um, if I go here, then he just gets his king. So I'll go here. Maybe then here and take the spawn. So the best move would be pawn forward, maybe. He doesn't play that anyways. Okay. I come back. Just trying to reroute my knight. And try to pressurize this. Yep, that's what he's doing now. I'll develop as well so that this is covered. Oh, he can take this. Damn. Missed it. I go here. Now, this is weak. Lost a pawn there. Can be tricky in end games, and this is one end game for sure. Does save it. I play pawn forward uh, and I'm stopping him from coming here. So I'll go here with my rook so that the pawn is always pinned somehow. Okay. What has he got? I play pawn forward. Just waiting for his moves. Oh, that is a nice one. But I can go here. I'm not pressurizing this. Yes, he gets to take it, but I get to take this. So he saves that, loses this, and this is defended now. And a fork is coming. That could have been a game changer right there. This doesn't work right now because his knight is there. And it still doesn't. Uh, where do we go with this? Rook. Mm. I have to come back and this is the only option. Place pawn forward. I'll go here trying to attack the pawn as well. I lost my goddamn rook. Huh, never saw that coming. This would be bad. Okay, I have this rook move. Maybe then trying to fork him if he tries to go somewhere wrong. This can still be won somehow. I don't know. Maybe on time. Maybe not won at all. Okay, I come here. Giving him a check. He can take. That would be nice with for him. I take with the pawn. He has got good pawn structure here. That can be handy. But instead, he's just trying to get me take this pawn next or oh, he takes this or oh, he takes one finally I'll take with the pawn and protect this as well and then go here uh, I should come back play pawn forward and go here and go up I'll go up 
I'll go up. Okay, I'll go up. Okay, he's gonna take that anyways. I'll go here. Take this, come back. So I can guard it. Play forward. Okay, is my queen coming first? Why do I think so? Okay, go up. Go up. Okay. Ah, wait, wait, what am I doing? Take this. Take this, get a queen on the board. Go here, take this, take this, take this, take this. Ah, phew. He flacked me on time. I think I was just trying to get the queen there first. Then I saw that rook is here, so I should take rook first. And that was never on auto promote, so yeah. Otherwise, it's it was a clean victory. But yeah, uh, it's good to have a draw from a losing situation than uh, anything else. So yeah, let's analyze the game quickly once from.